everybody, this is Ernie, and I just wanted to thank Darren and Lacey Tamura for this beautiful wind chime. And it's dedicated to my dog that uh, passed away July 30th. And um, they gave me this beautiful wind chime to uh, remember him by. And I will always be putting it um, up here to remember him. And hopefully when the wind blows, uh, I'll just remember him through this chime. So thank you, Darren and Lacey. I'm going to um, read this card that came along with it. And it says, um, Through the strongest of storms or the softest breeze, listen to the wind and think of me. I'm in the creaking of the trees, the breaking of twigs and falling leaves. I'm in the fresh dew space on a thirsty tomorrow. I'm through the prison of fear, trickling down in sorrow. I'm in all God's creations, and all you hold dear, just north of the clouds, for I am near. So it's a beautiful little poem, and it's dedicated to my beloved dog of 10 years, Lamar, that uh, we had to put down uh, on July 30th, Sunday, I believe, and... Um, it was very hard because he was such a great dog. He was a therapy dog. He was a service dog. He, w he was a uh, hospice dog. And he did a lot for the community. He made over 600 visits to the uh, hospitals and convalescent homes in this area here. So it says here, meet me at the Rainbow Bridge. And I certainly will. And... I want to thank you for watching this. This is not a normal video that I normally do, but I just wanted to make sure that uh, I thank Darren and Lacey for this wind chime, and I want to thank everybody for supporting uh, Lamar when he was alive, when we went to um, hospitals and places like that, and I'll, I'll never forget the guy ever and uh, in my life. And... Uh, Bye, Lamar. I'll be waiting for you. Hey there. It is uh, the middle of December, and uh, we're on our way to go visit the children at the College View School. It's one of uh, Lamar's clients over there. And uh, he looks like he's pretty happy and ready to go, right, Lamar? Are you ready to go to see the kids? All right, cool. This is Lamar, he's a four-year-old lab mix. It never was like this in the beginning. It was, he was a really tough dog. Uh, but later on, he turned into a great dog. Here's a little story about Lamar. Lamar was born on January 10th, 2013. He was part of a nine pup litter. These dogs had Lab, Mastiff, and Pitbull mixed in. He was born in Tahunga, California, and when I got him, he was only 20 pounds. Using the crate system, he was really easy to housebreak because he'll just whine and moan in the uh, crate, and that's when he needs to go to the bathroom. So basically, he did all the destroying, of plants and uh, tarps and uh, hot tub covers when he was a uh, young pup and uh, he basically just flunked out being a bomb sniffing dog. However, he graduated with ease through PetSmart, uh, the AKC and Love on the Leash Therapy Pet Organization. Okay, so we're on our way to College View School uh, it's in Glendale, California. It is right across the street from Glendale Community College. And uh, here we are at College View School. Okay, come on, Lamar. Let's go.
Okay, we're inside the, the school and one of the first things we do is we get water for the dog so he could refresh himself before he visits the kids. Everybody, we are over here at Foothill Retirement. You got your good old buddy here, Lamar. He's he's raring to go. Okay, come on, Lamar. Let's get in there. Okay. Lamar sniffing the bushes before he. Sh oh boy. Okay. Well. All right.
make a nice shape there for you. Alrighty, so we're here at a convalescent uh, facility here, and I got got this guy. Come on, get out of there. You stick around here. And I also have a cat. Okay, so we're at the uh, front door of the convalescent hospital. Got a cat in a box here. His name is Albert. And here he is right here. You can see him. Where, where is he? Okay, well, he's in there. And of course, there's uh, Lamar, so we're going to go inside now. Lamar, come on. Let's go. Yeah, he knows where his patients are. Okay, go see your patient. There you go. It's a beautiful 